Most well that ends well. Unless there are more of these fuel trucks around the city. My wife wonders why my blood pressure's so high. are getting creative. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. That's my way in. Hideouts. I'm surprised Sable had you working alone on this. I resigned from Sable International in order to ensure the supplies made it to some carrier. Guess she's a true mercenary at heart. Even choosing weapons over aid for her own people. Sable is more than a mercenary. Trust me. Anyway, let me know if you find those supplies. And thank you. That's me. We need to do something. Something Great patrolling, but I do have notes. Nobody asked you. That's nothing compared to what the boss will do to you! Mm. Huh? Okay. When there was only one set of footprints, that's when I webbed you up. Guys, just hand over the humanitarian aid and nobody gets a foot sandwich. Hey, David, got a question. What is that noise? Are you fighting right now? Oh, yeah. I'll try to keep it down. I was just wondering, how much do you know about Sable's home country, Simkaria? Well, the Simkarian government has been consolidating power for over a decade. They are now effectively a dictatorship. The opposition party, led by the Sablinova family, was either exiled or executed. Simkaria has been in civil war ever since. Meanwhile, the civilians are caught in the middle, with no way to escape and no way to go they do. So Sable might have lost some of her family in the conflict. Yes, the conflict in Simkaria is more personal to her than she would ever let on. Quit messing around! Guys, no more calling for backup. My toes are sore from all the face kicking. You picked up that thing to mess with us. That's not good. Just take a break to restock our gadgets and mend our costumes, please?
guys are super late to the party. We already broke the pinata and everything. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> Done and done. Now, where are those supplies for David? There they are. Hi, David. I recovered some of your supplies. Sending you the location now. Thank you, Spider-Man. I will get there as fast as I can. Great. And if it helps, I have a couple police contacts. I can ask them to help you out if... Oh, no, no, no. That will not be necessary. I have it under control. Thank you again. Huh. Alrighty. I think I'm close to another crime scene. Hmm, mystery person's calling card. I remember Yuri saying this was ruled an accidental death. Food poisoning, I think. I'm feeling a little uncomfortable. I think we should end the session. Sorry, Doc. I didn't mean to scare you. I've just been paranoid lately. Like I said, stressful job. Okay. <laughs> Tell me a little bit more about your job. Describe a typical day. Hmm. Typical day? I guess it starts with waking up, checking my phone, see what the boss wants me to hit that day. Then I go grab breakfast. I've been trying to do that keto thing, you know? Then I do the hits. Sometimes it's messy, so I gotta head home and clean up. I try to get to the gym in the afternoon, then dinner, and I... Sorry, um... Can you go back for a moment? What does... do a hit mean exactly? It means I kill who my boss tells me to. I'm pretty good at it by now. Got quite the resume. <laughs> this guy sounds like a Magia Enforcer. Feels like this is just part of the story. 
I should keep an eye out for more scenes like this. Should be close. Whoever's setting up these scenes really likes the color yellow. Another crime report. I remember this. A person got electrocuted accidentally, but the victim had ties to Hammerhead. Yuri tried, but couldn't find evidence of foul play. Let's hear what the recorder has to say. So what do you think, Doc? Well, clinically, you're a sociopath. You have no remorse for your actions. You clearly are not stressed. I doubt you think there's actually anything wrong with you. So, why did you really come see me today? <laughs> you're smart. I like that. Okay, let's get right to it, then. You do what I tell you, and I won't kill your family. Whoa. You want to get right to it? Okay, then. I know why you're really here. I knew who you were the minute you walked in that door. And I also know that before I do anything for you, you're going to do something for me. Well, that took a turn. These crime scenes all feel like covers for Magia hits. And if the guy on the tape is a Magia enforcer, maybe he's the one who killed all these people. Long time no see! I need to track down those bombs before they go off. Out this debris. Gotta find the last wow, bomb. What a great shot! You are on the right track. What are you doing? It's right there. What? You think they're just gonna leave it out in plain sight? I look good doing it. Yes! My subscriber count has never been higher!
Better take a closer look. Lots of police tape and equipment at these scenes. Whoever's doing this must have access to this stuff. Whoever left these wanted me to look closer at these accidents. I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. On the last recording, the therapist turned the tables on the Magia guy. Welcome back. Have a seat. So, did you bring the, um... Yeah. Hope this takes care of your cash flow problem. Right. It most certainly does. Thank you. So, I assume you came to me because I have a few police officers as clients. You assume correct. But my boss and I are only interested in one of them. And who might that be? Captain Yuri Watanabe. Yuri? How is she mixed up in this? I'm afraid of where this story is going. I have to keep following it. Hey, don't leave! I just got here! Thing my gadgets are so awesome. You got a death wish? Right. I need help. Good, good. Now finish him. I let you have two gadgets, Spidey. Use them both. Don't let him shock you with that thing. Gotta be somewhere nearby. Another setup for me. Yeah, yeah, savior of New York. Another file and recorder. Riker's breakout happened. Way less saving to do. I remember Yuri telling me about a drowning here. She was suspicious because the victim was a competitive swimmer. 
In the last recording, they talked about getting Yuri's mental health records. Here's Captain Watanabe's file. Hmm. This is everything. Yes. You ever record his sessions? No, I never record any sessions. That'd be unethical and illegal. Well, we'd like you to record the next session. And my boss has a list of questions he'd like you to ask. That gonna be a problem for you? No, no, no problem. I feel like I shouldn't be listening to these. And yet I can't stop. Seems that whoever left these wasn't satisfied with what the police concluded. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. There's the entrance. Clever. Hi, David. Just found another Hammerhead hideout. Please, be careful. I will. So, what happens when we get all the caches? Some stamps on them and celebrated Eddie's pizza? <laughs> Eddie's, yes. I will miss that place. He's not going out of business, is he? Please tell me he's not. <laughs> no, no. It's just. It's nothing. And do not worry about shipping. I will take care of it when the time comes. Ground now? What's a red light? Asking for a friend. Everything going okay? Oh sure, you know the usual. But I'm glad you called. How did you end up working for Sable International anyway? I guess you could say the job found me. Go on. No, seriously, Hammerhead's guys aren't great conversationalists. Back home, I was a math teacher. I wanted to open my students' eyes to the possibilities beyond our village, even when the rebel uprising began. And people started leaving the village. My students still came to school. And yet, if I had known what was to come, maybe I would have acted differently. It happened in the morning, right as school began. There were nine of them, all with automatic rifles. They asked for names, but I would not give any. Their patience wore out. They raised their rifles to shoot me. And that's when she came in. Who? Silver Sable. She took out the whole group. She saved me and the children. And that is why I owe her my life. Oh. For a heartless mercenary, she's sometimes almost likable. Sometimes.
sure hope so. You guys are terrible hosts. Okay, those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. Time to find that stash of humanitarian aid. There are the supplies. Okay, David. Found a bunch more supplies here. I'll send you the location. You are doing a great thing. Each supply cache could save hundreds of some carrion lives. Why Simcaria, if you don't mind me asking? I merely wish to help the children of Simcaria, as I once failed to help those who relied on me most. Thank you again for finding those supplies. I will come by to get them soon. Hmm. Huh. Sounds like David's carrying around a little guilt. Like most of us, I guess. Closer. I hope whoever's leaving these has a good reason.
police ruled this a suicide, but Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. All of these reports are from the last year or so. But last month, Yuri assigned herself to all of these cases. Was Yuri the one who left all those recordings? Okay, Yuri, let's move on. Have your obsessive thoughts about the suspect continued? Yes. Sometimes I feel like I've almost got him. And sometimes I feel like I'll never get him. Are you doing your breathing exercises? Trying to. But... I know who he is. I know where he is. And I know what he's done. But I can't do anything. Not without legally admissible evidence. That must be frustrating. You have no idea. Seems like Yuri's hunch is that the guy on the tape is the guy that killed all these people. I think she might be right. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. Huh, must be underground. Guess it's time for some urban spelunking. <laughs> Hi, David. I think I found the last hideout. Great work. So, I was thinking, maybe we should store the caches at a local police precinct, just for safekeeping. I would prefer to safeguard them myself. I get the sense you're not telling me something. I had a work visa with Sable International. It became invalid when I quit. Even an ID check right now could mean immediate deportation. I merely wish to finish this one task, and then I will go. Maybe I could help you with the whole immigration thing. Do not worry for me. This was my choice, and I have no regrets. Sleep it off. your vitamin D levels. Hey, what's up? Hi, MJ. Can I ask a huge favor? Sure, what's up? Remember that story you did on the shortage of teachers in the city? Well, I know someone who might be a good fit. If he had a visa. I think some of the supers are offering h one b based on credentials. Send me his info and I'll call around. I'll break your friggin' jaw! nickel for every time I heard that. Wait, do they even make nickels anymore? Uh, as soon as I finish here, I'm gonna look that up. guys. Oh! <laughs> 
if you guys all came out at once, you'd have a better chance of... Wait, better not give him any ideas. Looks like I cleared the place out. Whew. Now to find the supply cache for David. This must be the cache of humanitarian aid. David, the final supply caches are secure. Thank you. I will take them all to the Simkarian Embassy and make sure the aid is delivered. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. I will. And thank you once more, Spider-Man. Guess that's it. Hope MJ can pull some strings for him. Hey, David, what's up? Spider-Man, I have the supply caches and I'm on my way to the embassy, but I think I am being followed. Where are you? I am not sure. I am... David! David! Hold on! I'm on my way! Hammerhead's men knew David would be alone and vulnerable. I should have seen this coming. Hang in there, David. David. He's in trouble. Gotta move. Ah! 
Hi, David. You look like you could use a little help. Okay? I think so. Thank God for this sable armor. So, what's next? Deliver the caches to the Simkarian embassy. Thanks to you, the Simkarians will finally get the aid they need. Just happy I could help. <laughs> but I meant what's next for you? Well, a few minutes ago I received a call from a school in Midtown. They offered me a visa if I accepted a teaching position. I don't suppose you had something to do with that. Good things happen to good people. I can't thank you enough. I will try every day to help my students achieve their dreams, as you have helped me achieve mine. Actually, I should be the one thanking you. For what? For reminding me why I'll always love this city. Is it me, or is the world a little brighter right now? I'm just gonna bask in this good feeling for at least the next few seconds. Or until something else bad happens. Back and quietly reflect 
on just how right J. Jonah Jameson really was. Yet again. I think I'm close. It has to be Yuri who's leaving all this stuff. Someone fell to their death from this ledge. It was ruled an accident, but was it? On the last one, Yuri sounded frustrated. You have no idea. That's it? Yes. I mean, we talked a little bit about her medication, but... When is the next session? Why? What are you going to do? I'm gonna do whatever my boss does, maybe, though. Oh, no. Are they setting up a hit on Yuri? Gotta get to those other locations. guys back behind bars for good. Guess it's time to swing the van hammer. Ready to upload some more premium content? We're trending! Woo! Keep it up, SM! The comments are blowing up! We want more photo bombs! And to ice this loser! Not getting away with that!
received one shot! Tommy, get up! Come on, get up! Get your filters ready! It's photobomb time! I'm gonna clip your wings! that I find validation in acing a lunatic's challenge? Because I really do. Well done! <laughs> and you thought you were famous before. I'm getting close. It has to be Yuri who's leaving all this stuff. and recorder. I almost don't want to listen. These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well, the chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing breathing exercises. Well, isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell if you don't. Also, you're doing great. You're a very authentic looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is, does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? We catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer, he gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find her. I think I'm close to the last crime scene location. Yuri's been here. Now where's the file? Do you, like, do something? There's the case file. And the last recording. This looks familiar. I think it's the last known location of a Magia informant who disappeared a few months ago. Hey, Captain. You ready for this? Ready as I'll ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. Hi. Can I just get a large coffee? Hey there, Don. Who's that you were just talking to? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I listen to that? Call from an unknown number. Hello? Hello, old friend. Yuri? Meet me at the corner of Madison and 23rd. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri! Ah, she's gone. With all that's happened to Yuri, she must be beyond hurting. 
She doesn't do anything without a reason. So why did she leave me on a grisly crime scene tour? She must have a lead on this enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with whatever she's dealing with. What? Yuri, what did you do? It's the Magia Enforcer. Dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Yuri! I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time. But there are times when it doesn't. And to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever. But I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can. And you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. You do what you have to do. And I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Yuri! What am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead. She's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions. That must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him? That's too much. Excuse me, pardon me!
Hey, don't leave! I just got here! these guys ha! I was gonna suggest a dance off but this is way more fun I scared you blah, blah, blah. smoke monster 42 asks can we do another photo bomb ha! you bet we can you got a death wish I can tell oh you. yay my newest fans are here and they're sporting the latest streaming tech hammerhead guys why did it have to be hammerhead guys Screwball is the ultimate narcissist. There's no way she'd miss her own party. Gotta find out where it is.
Maybe one of her fans posted something about it. If only I knew someone who had time to scour a bunch of social media posts. Hello? Hey, hey Pete. I'm just checking in. Miles, are you... Did you just hear what I said? You said hello. Huh. Guess your timing is just weirdly perfect. Anyway, I got a mission for you. Like a spider mission? Oh man, let's do this! I need you to look through social media and find the location of Screwball's 50 millionth follower party. Oh. Okay. Sure. I'll call you as soon as I find something. While I wait for Miles, I can do some Spidey patrolling. sense to me. Just like Spider-Man. Yeah, we got back together during the quarantine. Wait till mom sees this. Now I'm starting to pretend I'm a guy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hey, I got a business proposition. Hey, you the real Spider-Man? <laughs> nah, can't be. I still don't trust you. Hi. I just want an app that's a daily live trivia game show. I'd love to have you on the app. Could you, like, uh, do something? Hey, turn this way. What's up? Hey, sounds corny, but. Uh, you're Over my here. Hero. Please don't touch the suit. Miles, what do you got? Check it out. Miles, that's great. Thanks so much. You want me to meet you there? Uh, just in case you need some backup? No, but don't worry. We'll get you out in the field soon enough. Cool. Okay, can't wait. Like, literally, waiting is really hard. <laughs> I know, Miles, I know. Talk soon. Okay, rooftop party near Church and Broom. I think the saddest thing about Screwball is that, in a way, she's a victim of her own fans. Most criminals have an end goal. But I don't think Screwball does. She's just a social media addict. As long as her fans keep giving her validation, she's going to keep doing more and more dangerous stunts. Which is why I need to stop her. Tonight. Okay, Screwball must be here somewhere. Unless she's faking me out again. This feels like a party she'd want to attend. Hey, y'all! Hope you're having fun! Don't forget to tag me in your selfies! Oh, look! Spider-Man's here! <laughs> what a nice surprise! Everyone ready for the season finale? Screwball! Don't move! Come on! The world is watching! 
Just because people are watching, it doesn't mean you're any better of a person. Wow, mood killer. Try to keep the banter life fun, okay? Who wants to see some photobombs? I do, I do. Stop! No way, Jose! Look at that spike in concurrent viewers! We got it! Oh, oh! Don't miss the photo bomb! Time for a twist! Man, everybody's got drones these days. Scratch one drone. Finally, time to get close and finish this. You're forward! You only caught me because I wanted you to catch me! Look how many followers I gained! Yes! You guys know who I am, right? <laughs> of course you do. Mind if I live stream on the way to the station? Officially unfollowed. <laughs> 